head is off. If you're in the market for a gun, an East Tennessee store is offering a deal as long as you're a Christian. The owner of Frontier Firearms says the mass shooting in Oregon prompted the sale. Local 8 News reporter Danny Roberti is joining us. And Danny, the deal only for people who claim to be of a particular faith. Amanda, that's right. You can see this ad right behind me. It was posted on Facebook saying you can save 5% off any new handgun. The only catch, you have to walk in and say you're a Christian. And if Christians are going to be targeted, we need to protect ourselves. And the best way to protect yourself is with the best weapon available, and that happens to be a handgun. Now gun store owner Brant Williams is taking a state leader's suggestion. Last week after the tragic shootings in Oregon, Lieutenant Governor Ron Ramsey encouraged Christians who are serious about their faith to think about getting a handgun carry permit. Ron Ramsey had a good point. Christians need to arm up. So he's offering 5% off any new handgun if you say you're a Christian. I don't think it's a matter of proving or disproving. It's just say the words, I'm a Christian, and get the discount. Williams says this is important because people are targeted for their beliefs. He doesn't want to hide his faith. And we can stand up and not worry about being shot for our beliefs. Or maybe we can stand up and shoot back. Cameron Brooks is the chairman of the Knox County Democratic Party. Anyone that's not Christian in our society um, is excluded. And I think that's wrong. I think it turns people away from Christianity. He supports the Second Amendment, but doesn't think guns are the answer. It's not about owning a gun and, you know, retaliation and, and promoting more violence in our society. It's about promoting peace. I'd like to also let Christians know that there are businesses out there, even though the laws try to silence us, and uh, those that oppose us try to silence us, we won't be silenced. Now, William says he's never refused to sell anyone a gun and welcomes customers of all religions. All right, Danny Roberti reporting for us tonight. Friends of a little girl who was shot and killed in Jefferson County say the 11-year-old boy who murdered her also bullied her. Local 8 News reporter.